Okay, uh, so now I will discuss the switch system itself, professor switch system. Uh, so uh, I returned my camp, as you can see, to a day mode. This is what this is essentially what we call a day mode, right? So uh, most of the items are regeneration speed ones, and there is just a bit, tiny bit of capacity here. Um, so. Uh, uh, so we can uh, have a little time to breathe, right? Currently, as you can see, it will fit, fill in 33 minutes. So this is our typical day mode. There are al almost only regeneration speed items. Uh, there are uh, almost al almost no or completely none. You could make such a, a mode too, um, capacity items. So now... Uh, what switch system does is uh, it actually uh, simply uh, automatizes the process which I already shown you uh, a while ago. So instead of uh, exchanging all the items manually, like hiding this, putting another one, you, you just do it with one click, right? So how do we, uh, how do we set it up is the next uh, question and well, first we need to buy it, right? So, to buy the switch system, we need to navigate to the extras tab. And here, uh, as you can see, we have uh, different uh, extras to buy. Uh, so, Professor switch system costs uh, 250 gems. And there is no way to buy it for free. Uh, this may be uh, for, for normal materi materials at least right so this may uh, deter some people but uh, bear in mind that you, this is a number of gems that you will easily be able to amass for free in no time on a new account achievements bonuses special events you will get there very soon and quite frankly this is like uh, the best way you can spend any gems because this saves you time and time is money right Time is money, simply. Okay, so uh, without uh, yeah, so let's simply purchase it now, right? Bye bye, gems. Are you sure you want to buy? Yes, hell yes, I am sure. Okay, so now we have the switch system, and as you can see, a new icon has appeared here at the top near your energy bar. It has uh, a diggy on it, right? So if you uh, as you can see, nothing has changed so far in my camp. This is the day mode which I set manually before. And now, if you click at, on this button, it will change the mode. So, at this point, many people uh, panic, like, Oh, where are all my items, right? Uh, my items disappeared. Yeah. Oh, it doesn't work, it's only 200 capacity. Right, so... Don't worry, this is normal. Uh, this is the, 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 the second preset of items that you need to set manually. Right? So, uh, okay, if you, click, uh, if you click it again, right? You click it again and you come back to your day mode. So what you want to do now is to create a... Uh, to create here. A mode that will have mostly capacity and some region so it is balanced around your time of sleeping at night right so about six seven hours I guess okay so let's set uh, let's set our night mode right now okay so I just finished setting the night mode uh, as you can see a lot lots of capacity items here uh, just a bit regeneration Two here and a couple slots here. Other than that, it's all regeneration. And these are the statistics which we ended up with. So, uh, 3,165 uh, uh, maximum capacity, and this will be filled in just under seven hours. So, perfect for sleeping, for uh, leaving to work school, university, uh, I don't know, Nordic walking, <laughs> a trip, uh, whatever, right? So this, uh, in this way, uh, we can leave 
for seven hours no problem right so as you remember this is what we said in the second mode right so now we can just go to this button here click it and bam we are back to our day mode right as you can see 919 per hour fills in for uh, in 30 minutes great yes and click we are back to the night mode and that's basically it this is uh, what the switch system is it automatically switches between two presets of items of course you can uh, adjust uh, the statistics as you wish you can uh, make two modes that will feel for for a longer time right i'm not saying no i'm not saying it's bad some people work a lot some people just don't have time some people don't want to play a lot so in that case they could set a mode uh, that fills up for 12 hours and the other one that fills up in 5 hours right just just use it right use it and use the items change the items swap them uh, upgrade them whenever you can the better items the better stats obviously right you have uh, you have the whole shop, the special events, so just get all those, right? Just try to buy an upgrade whenever you possibly can, right? Okay, and uh, so two more things which I would like to mention at the end. Uh, so some people, uh, some people believe you need uh, different items for for two modes right they they try, they are they are saying they won't set up another set because they don't have uh, they don't have uh, enough items right and this is not true because as you can see this is my day mode here right and here is the obelisk of isis as you can see it is uh, set here and then when we change the mode it's here right so the same items can be used in both modes no problem with that Right, and here's the tin depository, which is also used in the day mode. Uh, and additionally, the other second thing I would like to mention here is that it can work as a safety valve. So, for example, when we look here, and let's say we accidentally click here, right? We shouldn't because this this is a great item. We don't want to buy it, but uh, sell it. But uh, we click by mistake, right? You see what is happening? You can't sell this equip because it belongs to the other set. So this uh, this also works as a safety measure because you just can't sell uh, sell the items that are in in the other set. Right. So that's just another minor bonus from having the switch system. Yes, yeah, so um, that's pretty much it. Uh, switch system allows quick switching between two sets of items of your own choosing great thing mandatory thing actually obligatory something that you can't really play with and uh, people who tell you otherwise well um, I guess their time isn't really worth uh, I don't know my time is simply worth more than uh, 250 gems right I, I would have to uh, do this from scratch two times per day at least and if you play for months or years this amounts to like hours or days of time wasted on just switching items so uh, yes definitely buy it and buy it as soon as you can it's pretty much uh, a required thing okay so that sums it up pretty much I hope uh, you are acquainted with how it works and uh, I hope you found this video useful and yeah see you next time see, uh, in the event, event guides and uh, maybe in the next tutorials for the game itself <laughs>